Hey guys, I'm Ravana, and today I'm gonna tell you 50 things about me. I know it's a lot of things. I didn't think I could come out with 50 things about me, but I guess it's something that I can share with you guys so you guys can get to know me a little bit more and we probably will have some things in common. This is Solo Por Hoy, it's in Spanish, but in English, it's just for today. Number one is I was born in San Diego, California. My family is from Tijuana, Mexico on August 11th, 1989. So I am 26 years old. My height is 5'2", so I am petite. <laughs> I lived in Tijuana, Mexico up until age eight. And then we came to live here in San Diego. And I remember the first days of class when I was in school here in the US, I barely knew any English and I couldn't understand anything that the teacher said. But after like a couple weeks, I started to learn. In the way that I am, I am more like my dad, but physically I feel like I look in between the both. I have a lot of energy, like it's hard for me to stand still and I love to be doing something all the time. Like all day I'm like, I go to exercise and then I go do this and I do that and I'm always doing something. I don't like uh, to fall into routine. So having like a very like monotonous life or doing the same thing all the time, like I don't like it. I like to be doing different things all the time. I am very passionate and intense. Like if I really like something, I go like all in for it or it's either all in or nothing. Very like intense. I'm the oldest out of three. I have a younger brother and a younger sister. And I'm also the oldest out of grandchildren from my mom's side and my dad's side. So I've always been very independent due to the fact that I'm the oldest. When I was little, I used to love gymnastics and I was in gymnastics from age three to 12. I fractured my left wrist two times. One time when I was six years old, jumping from the swing and the other time, going downhill on a scooter when I was 10 and it became very weak. So I had to stop doing gymnastics. Mm. My favorite color is white. I've never had a pet or a dog, but lately I've been really, really wanting to adopt a puppy or a cat. So what do you guys like more? Please let me know in the comments below. I need help. Something about me is I like to say things as they are. Like it's hard for me to keep something inside of me. I have to say it. I tend to be like very honest and frank about it. And when it's something about someone else, I have to just think about it first because I don't like to hurt other people's feelings, but I'm very like that. Like I need to say it, like take it all, like take it all out. <laughs> I love meeting new people, talking to people. I like having lots of different kinds of friends and just meeting people in general. I find everyone so different and unique. I love it. I like to eat with little forks and little spoons. <laughs> you know, the ones that are for dessert. Well, those are the ones I like to use for my food. It's like I savor every little bite. I love herbal teas, infusions, just makes me warm. I love tea houses, just love it. My favorite food before I was vegan was fish, specifically sashimi. I would like it in any shape or form or alone or just with lime. But now I look at it and I see it as something dead. And so I personally don't like to put like dead things inside of my body. My favorite class during school was math when I understood it, like algebra, statistics. I really like that. I was never really like a straight A student or never cared much about academics. My favorite class was always like lunchtime, but in the end I graduated and I went to school. I guess it's important to just learn something new every single day. When I first graduated from high school, I was 17 and I went to live to LA for one year. That's where I spent my first year of college. And then I went to Paris for three and a half, almost four years. And that's where I finished my college degree of international business in an American university. Traveling is my biggest passion. And ever since I was little, I got the opportunity to travel a lot. I've been to every continent except Australia. And I have to go soon because I have so many Instagram 
people that I want to meet that live in Australia. One of my favorite cities in the whole world is Hong Kong. The first time that I went, I loved it. I fell in love with the city and I actually wanted to go live there after college, but I tried to apply to the school and it was just a little complicated with the language. And so I never did, but hopefully I'll go back again one day and maybe I'll live there one day. Who knows? I had my first boyfriend when I was 12 years old. I used to be a coffee lover. Americano with one Splenda was my go-to drink, but I cut it off around three years ago when I went vegan because it just gave me anxiety and the jitters and it was not good for me. My favorite fruit is watermelon. I can eat it all day, I love it. I've never had braces. These are my teeth. At night, I grind my teeth, so I have to wear a mouth guard. When I was 21 years old, I got my four wisdom teeth taken out all at once, and it was one of the most painful things I've experienced. <laughs> I tend to forget things easily. Like, I feel sometimes I just live in my own world. Like, in La La Land, I'm just like, I don't know, living in this magical fruity world sometimes, I feel. I'm very bad at, like, getting jokes. I'm just those kinds of persons that get the joke like a day later, that's me. Like, I'm so bad at that. <laughs> I'm very emotional and I cry for everything. If I'm super happy, I cry. Super sad or angry, I cry. Cry, 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 cry. <laughs> I cry all the time. I've always been a little bit afraid of the ocean. I know how to swim, but ever since I was little, my mom was like, don't go in the ocean, it's dangerous. And so it's something that I want to do more, just swim. When I was in high school, uh, one year I was in the golf team and the other year I was in the swimming team. So those are kind of the two sports that I like to do during high school. I tried alcohol for the first time on my high school graduation when I was 17 and I got drunk. It was in Mexico. And I do not encourage underage drinking or abusing alcohol. I was three years old when I took my first trip with my parents to Puerto Vallarta. <laughs> I make this really weird noise with my throat and it's like this. And I usually do it when I have allergies or when it's really cold and sometimes it's unconsciously. So I remember when I was in school, I'd be in class and I'd start doing it and everyone would get quiet and just like look at me and I was like, what, what did I do? <laughs> I've been vegan for three years, yay! I love to dance. It just puts me in a good mood when I'm in a party. I love to dance, 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 dance. Just makes me happy. My favorite kind of music is house music. I like all kinds of music, but house is my favorite. My favorite exercise is walking. It relaxes me. It's like a good workout and I could do it anywhere. My favorite movie is Frida Kahlo. I love Frida's story, how she was just herself and didn't care. I admire her. My favorite time of the year is summertime because it's when all the fruits and veggies are in season. I can't wait for that. My favorite books are one, The Power of Now by Iker Tolle, two, The Alchemist, uh, Paulo Coelho, and of course, The Bible. I, when I started understanding the Bible, it really taught me a lot about who I truly am, pure love. My favorite passage in the Bible is Genesis 129, which says that everything that bears fruit and seeds is ours to eat. And it just tells me that fruits and vegetables were made for us to eat. My favorite actor is Leonardo DiCaprio. I love him. I have a huge crush on him. <laughs> and my favorite actress is Selma Hayek. My favorite artist, uh, music artist, is Justin Bieber because of the way that he is, his story, and his music lately is really good. And another one that I really like is Kanye West. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I know it was long, but <laughs> I just run, wanted to do it so that you guys can get to know me more. Send you guys lots of love, light. Let me know in the comments below what you guys thought about it or if we have things in common, would love to know that. Subscribe here to my channel if you haven't subscribed and like this video helps me so, so much. And I also leave you my Instagram and Facebook and Snapchat and Twitter, all at Ravana in the description of this video, okay? Bye.